Uh, the governor of your state said that the uh, that this doesn't solve any problems. It, it escalates the situation. And we've been watching police and federal forces and National Guard engage with protesters since May 25th across this country. And in the vast majority of cases, it has inflamed the situation as opposed to calmed it. Absolutely. And that's the case here. Uh, a dramatic overreaction. Uh, the sort of the stormtrooper tactics, uh, it, luckily it is all on video. People can see for a fact that there isn't any large menacing crowd, uh, riot. There's, uh, an innocent, uh, relatively, it uh, looks like an innocent bystander who rolled a tear gas canister that was, uh, thrown his way, uh, shot by, uh, non-lethal, uh, weapon, uh, fractured his skull, um, this is outrageous. And uh, if Donald Trump knew what he was doing, maybe he could be helpful. But I think it's a deliberate effort to make the situation worse. They've certainly managed to do that here in Portland. Uh, Donald Trump tweeted about this, uh, crossing state lines to incite violence is a federal crime. Lib liberal governors and mayors much get, must, must get much tougher on the federal government is going to step in and do what has to be done. And that includes using the unlimited power of our military and many arrests. Uh, I guess this works for some people in his base, but it, it, it's really not what most people think the U.S. military is for. Absolutely. Absolutely. And in fact, what we've seen here in Portland, uh, things have uh, been challenging in the past. Things have been quieted down. Uh, but moving in here, unlimited force, uh, things like taking uh, bystanders uh, with people who are not clearly identified of uh, who they are, uh, not identified, shoving them into unmarked cars and taking them away. Um, this is a banana republic. Uh, this is something that is not calculated to calm a difficult situation, uh, and we don't need it. Our governor, our mayor, the congressional delegation uh, has no interest in having this outside interference with people who are not trained in trying to help keep the peace and instead are inflaming the situation. I, I you know, the, Charlie Pierce used the word pinocheting, uh, and you, you bring up something that I think is important. You see these, these uh, officers, I, I don't know what to call them because we don't really know entirely yeah. who they are. Uh, they don't have badges, they don't have names. Uh, they could be from different federal uh, organizations. Uh, the cars, they're, they're using unmarked vehicles. We just saw one there uh, on the screen. Right. If, if this is a legitimate law enforcement effort, none of that would have to happen. Law enforcement in this country are supposed to wear badges, identify themselves, have numbers. Uh, the cars say police or National Guard or military on them. This is very unusual that it, it, it seems to be these, these secretive tactics. Absolutely. And if you're interested in keeping the peace and helping with law enforcement, you would coordinate uh, with the local police, with the local authorities. Uh, they're not there at our in, uh, invitation. Uh, they made no effort to work with us in a cooperative fashion. Uh, and things that are recorded on video that people can see for themselves uh, have no place in the streets of America's cities. What do we do about the accountability issue? One of the reasons police have badges is that you can identify them. Uh, these are uh, these people are masked. They have uh, gas masks on in many cases. They, they're in full uh, combat gear. Uh, do you think there's an effort here to escape accountability? Absolutely. I mean, this is uh, the uh, uh, the operating mode of the Trump administration, debating responsibility, maybe trying to deflect attention from things that are his responsibility, like dealing with the pandemic uh, and the coronavirus, uh, and instead uh, uh, having an opportunity here for people intervening uh, in a way that is uh, just it, it's scandalous. We are going to work to try and have legislation that help rein this in, limit the powers, have an investigation to find out what actually happened uh, to blow the cover off their story.